Bene. The gentlewoman from Washington State's recognized for one minute. Thank you. This weekend, millions of women marched across the country to send a clear signal to Congress and President Trump. Hear our voices and protect our rights. Yet here we are, just two days later, voting on the same extremist policies that House leaders have been pushing for years. Women will not be fooled. We know HR 7 is another direct attack on our health and our families. It creates sweeping new restrictions on abortion care for women who purchase coverage under the Affordable Care Act with no meaningful exceptions to protect a woman's health. That means women like Stephanie from my district who faced heartbreaking complications during her wanted pregnancy would be left without coverage for the doctor recommended care she needed. We should not be injecting ideology into a woman's personal medical decisions. This bill is an insult to the millions of women who marched this weekend, and I urge my colleagues to vote no. Yield back. The gentlewoman's time has expired.